Hey everybody, welcome to our home away from home. Come on in and let me give you a tour of our motor home. Summer's starting, vacations are coming, and this is what we will be taking our vacations in this summer. Entering the motor home here, we have got a reclining chair, which makes it really nice, makes it feel more like home. We also picked up one of these brown leather ottomans just to add to the living area. The driver's seat here and the passenger seat, they swivel in turn to add for more seating. The cabinets on each side of the TV are where we store most of our board games and puzzles. And this couch actually pulls out because it is a hide -a bed and it makes into a full-size bed and this is where Allie and Kayla both sleep. The blinds in this motorhome are amazing because they're day blinds and night blinds and so it really blocks out the lights at night. And of course, we've got to have one of Dollar Tree's dream catchers. And the dinette also turns into a bed. It sleeps one comfortably or two little ones. This is a solar lantern that I found at the 99 cent store last Christmas. I paid $4.99 for it. I picked up a couple of them because I thought that they'd be great for when we were camping in the motorhome. One of the things that I wanted most when we were looking for a motorhome was a double refrigerator. Because we have a family of five, that makes a lot of food that we take on our trips to Mammoth, which are 10 to 14 days long. And so having a refrigerator this size makes it easier so we don't have to make multiple trips to the store. Another main request was that I had a regular oven and stovetop along with a separate microwave. I definitely did not want a convection oven. When decorating the inside of the motorhome, and yes, I did decorate it because we do travel in this so often, I really wanted to bring some of our home, our decor style into the motorhome so it would make it feel more like home. And this also was another piece that I picked up from the 99 cent store for $1.99. I thought that this was a perfect piece to hold my pot holders and oven mitts on. Another one of the features that I absolutely loved in this motorhome was all of the storage. There is so much stinking storage in this. There is no shortage of it, that is for sure. All of the wall decals that I've put in the motorhome here in the bathroom and in the kitchen, I either found at the Dollar Tree or the 99 cent store. And of course, it is a must to add Bath and Body Works hot cocoa and cream candle to the motorhome. I love the smell of this and it is just perfect for camping. Another feature that we really liked about this motorhome is that the toilet and the sink were separate from the shower. And the master bedroom comes with an unbelievably comfortable queen size memory foam bed. This bed is amazing. With storage above our head. And of course we need a Scentsy warmer in here. All of the decorative towels that you see in the motorhome are just Walmart's basic towel. I took and wrapped raffia around them, took some dry flowers and stuck them in there to add just a bit of decoration to them. Rolling up a simple white towel and adding some twine around it is such a simple, inexpensive way to display towels.
This here is a second bathroom sink, which is right next to our shower. And for a motorhome, this has a really nice size shower. It is huge. And because there were no shelves inside the shower to put our shampoo and soaps, I bought this floor to ceiling shelf at Walmart. It's by Mainstays. I put these wall sconces up using the Velcro command strips. And again, for $1.99, found these at the 99 cents store. Amazing buy. The 99 cent store has amazing decor pieces for so inexpensive. This candle holder set was $1.99. And there you have our home away from home. RVing is my favorite vacationing time with my family. It gives us so many opportunities and different choices, places to go, things to see, and I love being able to do it as a family traveling in our home. What makes us comfortable and it's ours and we can just mobily take our home wherever we want and I love that. I hope you all enjoyed the tour of my motor home. Stay tuned for more RV upcoming videos where I show you how I organize this RV, getting the most out of the space that I have here with a family of five and some tips and tricks that I've picked up along the way over the last 13 years. Please give this video a thumbs up and let's get this video to 2000 likes. Until next time, everybody, I hope you have a fantastic day. Happy summer vacation, and bye for now, everybody. Bye.